All right. Yeah, this is a Patreon request from Dorfin. The last one was fire. Was um, Lydia Lydia Loveless was it? Something like that. It's fire. This is just a great name, Love Tractor. I don't know why that. I just thought that was funny. That just made me laugh. That actually made me made me laugh. I just thought that was such a weird combination of words. But yeah, um, we all loved each other so much. So, don't know this one again. Don't know nothing about this again. So yeah, but I trust Dolphin, to be fair. But yeah, let's go.
That was mental. I think that's the nearest piece of music to Zappa without obviously being influenced by it. Well, maybe they are, but it does. It was like that level of. First off, I was thinking the intro. This felt like one of them conversations when you start off talking about, like, you and your mate start off talking about, like, relationships or whatever. And then. Two hours later, that same conversation is about that Bigfoot might be an alien or something. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's what this felt like. Like, I hope everyone followed that. Like, note for note, and because it was super, super intricate with the, like, but it was all based around, that guitar player too is fire even though it wasn't <clears throat> a million notes a second and all of that to play that clean yeah that's what I was going to say at the beginning I was thinking it almost sounds like a, a real like if you took a Soundgarden song and then like took away all the overdrive and distortion and just made it all clean electric guitar it proper had a roll and and then it just went from bit to bit. But that riff is great. Every time that kind of come round when it went on like a um like a mission off road for a little bit and then comes back to Yeah. Just a happy riff. But a guitar player is fire. The way like to be fair, the whole thing was super rhythm based right even the back into it but it was like based around that guitar and I don't know there might be two guitar players or it might just be overdub but yeah a lot happened in that that's what I mean that's what I'm saying with it felt like one of them conversations because it just yeah a lot happened in that and then you had that kind of like it's it almost felt like for the first half of the song you you wasn't quite sure what we were settling in for. Was it gonna be bluesy? Was it gonna be this? Was it gonna be that? Was it gonna be yeah yeah? And I'd say that probably the nearest um, piece to being like a zapper piece. Or, or rush near to as, do you know what I mean? As kind of intricate and, um, yeah. Like I say, there was a lot of little things in there. 
a lot of different kind of rhythms of the drums. But then it was still very kind of that, like I say, that riff was just so catchy, so catchy, and just a great fun riff. Yeah. Yeah, that was a tune. Tune. But yeah, that's the reaction. Sweet. <laughs> 